So, welcome back, and today we're looking at the uh, Hunter by FLP Santos. He's currently missing in action, but we're still going to give him a quick whip around because he did have his place here in the queue. I just want to tell you, buddy, this is a pretty good style, nice color theme, uh, and the wedges look real nice as well. I'm looking at the crystal, the crystal's a nice touch. I always prefer the boom crystal for engines, I don't know why. Uh, the, the AMCs here look kind of like a those rail guns you get in like sci-fi shows, that's really nice. You can imagine the lightning just crackling between these two, which is sweet. Maybe that's just my imagination, but you know. Uh, it's got a nice nose profile on it, and the uh, missile arrays are quite tucked away there. Beautiful use of the beacons as they're just sticking out of the hull underneath. That's something which I've never done in my builds, and uh, I have yet to conquer. But as you can see here, we've got these weird ghost beacons that sometimes appear. And, that's why I'm a little allergic to them at the moment. But I do love the effects that you can pull off, so all credit for that. The turrets aren't too overpowered. I like turrets that aren't obvious. I give credit to people for that because it's easy to make a giant box that sticks off a giant box. But making a, making a turret that just blends in, you've got to get some credit for that, so that's really nice. Um, I apologize if I didn't get to see the interior, but then there's something for you to show me when you turn up. So, thanks to everybody watching, and we're going to get on to the next one in the review, so uh, see you next time.